What is up, you musty prison wallets? I'm McStud. And welcome to the motherfucking McStud show. It's motherfucking Monday. Meet Shank Monday. God damn, it should be Michael Bolton motherfucking Monday. And Mondays suck a bag of dicks. But first, tasty beverage. God damn it. Hope you're all having a great start to your week. Mondays suck a bag of dicks. So either way, we drinking. Not a lot. <laughs> oh, man. Boy, the Monday suck. Sucks having to wake up. I, I didn't really get a weekend. I got one day off. I got Thursday off, work Friday, work Saturday morning, had Sunday off. Sucks. I don't have to do that for, I think I'll work again until the weekend of the 20th or some shit. Anyways, what are the five words that every child loves to hear from their mother? Any ideas? They are. Put it in my butt. Sorry, I'm sorry. I'm just going hard like Bronny James in his Summer League debut. God, did you guys know that it was Nude Recreation Week this week? I didn't until today. You know, can we count work as a uh, recreation? You know, just walk up in that bitch, dick swinging. Okay, uh, maybe not swinging. You know, just resting on the balls. Either way, same shit, same idea. You know? Who needs to go to a fucking nudist colony for that shit? You can do it anywhere, you know? I just think it's funny that they call the nudist colonies colonies. Because the word colony has the word colon in it. And it's a bunch of naked people with their colons just hanging out. Hope, well, oh, hopefully not hanging out. You know, I don't want to see someone's pink sock hanging lower than their fucking balls, you know? It's just, it's just your, your butthole showing, you know? I don't think you want to fry up some bacon, though, in the nude. That's not a good recreation for Nude Recreation Week. Unless you just like grease burns on your cock and balls. Or meat flaps, titties, whatever. But personally, I believe the best nude recreational activity is paintballing. Followed by airsoft wars coming in at a close second. You know, I, I, I put paintballing first because there's nothing better than seeing where you hit your shot instantly. You know, right on the tip of the dick. Blue. <laughs> Man, and this is just for the older viewers, you know. Any of you ever fart while reciting the Pledge of Allegiance in school? I mean, you get to, uh, I pledge allegiance. <laughs> and bam, you gotta whip your head over real fast, you know, make it look like another student did it. You know, look, motherfucker, I just, I just pledged allegiance to that loud ass fart. We'll just have to chalk this up as a loss and try again tomorrow morning, you know? You guys ever realize how fucked up the Pledge of Allegiance really is, you know? Like, I get supporting your country, your country's flag, defending your country, loving your country. And I have nothing respect for those who serve our country and sacrifice everything for all of us every day. Forgive us the fucking freedoms that we have to do shit like this or whatever the fuck it is that we may want. Um, but liberty and justice for all... You know, history has shown that that is not always the case. Especially if you got fucking money, you know. There's political corruption, corrupt law enforcement. You know, you got truly innocent people being locked up while we have guilty motherfuckers just walking the streets. And liberty? You know, fuck. Look at cancel culture. You can't say this. You can't say that. This is an example. And then lastly, under God. What the fuck if you don't believe in God? You can't be... Does that make you not a citizen of your own country? Well, you are free to have your own fucking beliefs. And kids were forced to say this shit every morning, first thing at school, you know. I was. We all, first thing in the morning, you know, you do the Pledge of Allegiance, you know. Get the fuck out of here with that shit, you know. Why not recite the National Anthem? That'd be a lot more patriotic and a lot more understandable. You know, without all that liberty and justice for all bullshit, you know. No, it's not liberty and justice for all. It's liberty and justice for some. It always has been. You know, and if you argue that, you're just fucking blind to the shit that happens every fucking day in this country. But enough about that bullshit. I'm going to jump off here. Um, and remember, everybody, paying for sex doesn't count when it's at the morgue. I'm excited. Deuces, bitches. Ugh.